If you ever wondered why night vision devices can't see colors at night and they only produce this uh, black and white uh, picture very often with this green cast, there's a very simple answer to that. But before I answer that, I need to ask you another question. What is color? So color, uh, you might think that it's the property of an object, but it's not. If you think about this, uh, the color depends on the light that you shine on an object. If you white uh, if you shine white colors or light with white colors like the sunshine onto something, it appears to be a certain color. If you shine red light, it changes. If you shine blue light, it again changes. It has a different color. So the color is the property not of an object, but of the light reflected off that object that comes to our eye or to a measuring device or a sensor in a device like this one. So at night, you probably have noticed there is very little light or no light at all. There might be some light reflected off the moon, but it's not enough to give e enough color information for a device like this. Uh, you could get the color information if you had a, a very good quality camera, normal camera, good quality, and it and you took very long exposure, half a minute or one minute or five minutes. There could be enough light to uh, decode the color information and have more or less the same uh, colors as during the daylight or very similar, but not in real uh, time. And remember, these devices, they were not designed to reproduce colors. They were designed to allow you to see things at night. So they are sensitive to infrared light. So uh, you could shine an infrared light on an object and it reflects back to through the lens to the sensor and the sensor then based on that infrared information builds a picture of what's happening uh, at night, yes? So infrared light doesn't carry any information about color. Infrared is actually invisible uh, to our eyes. That's why we need devices like this. And that's why then these devices also amplify that infrared light because there is very little of it. So once the infrared light gets here, it's, it gets decoded, but there is no information about the color, unfortunately, that would be useful to us. Now, this device, uh, it can actually work during the day and it can reproduce the colors. However, they're not very precise. They're quite distorted and sometimes it's kind of a hit and miss. They're quite good, but you cannot consider it uh, as a proper camera for daylight uh, pictures. Uh, why? Well, again, it's not been designed to reproduce colors during the day. Its primary function is to work at night and provide you good visibility. And if you wanted to also add the uh, daylight photos of high quality, obviously that would cost a lot of money. Don't, not to mention there is no point. Any camera, normal camera in your phone or even old compact camera will take much, much better picture of higher quality, higher resolution than, than this one because it's not been designed otherwise it would cost much much more and um, by the way these devices can be bought from uh, outlet shop uk uh, links below uh, thank you for watching see you in the next video